good wishes dear students in my part 1 of class 10th english first i have given you question 1 and in that two sub parts i have given you to practice in this class i will tell you how to attempt that two sub parts of question 1 so it is a composition question consisting of five different varieties of questions out of these five questions a candidate has to attempt any one of the question of his choice so first student has to read all the five questions carefully and has to pick up a question which is more convenient for him to impress the examiner in question 1a it will be a short story based on the given theme or certain phrases or outline given student has to write a creative story of his or her own in about 350 to 400 words these are the important things or points that the student has to keep in mind before attempting this type of questions the story should be narrated with a literary background of setting character building plot conflict denouncement student should write a story of their own creation but not a story of what they have lifted out from some other book or well known popular stories candidates will be heavily penalized in marks if they follow such a method in writing a story narration part of the story should be given much importance and student should bring out the idea or central theme given in the question by the end of the story now sometimes a student start the story with a male character and after sometimes they go on mentioning she instead of he in their story narration so these things you should keep in your mind sometimes a student start their story in past tense and finally ends the story in present tense student should avoid such blind mistakes while writing the story and such a thing will cost them much in getting good marks now question 1b that is based on a on imagination skill so here as i have given you in question 1b that imagine that there was a road accident in your colony describe the scene of accident and what you did to help the injured in this question student have to imagine the situation given and have to bring out their vivid feelings to make the reader to feel real student has to bring out his ideas to show a proper solution to the situation students have to feel them themselves in the situation and have to narrate their imaginative experience in a fitting way imagination of the situation is very important to bring out the best to write your experience on the answer sheet i hope uh, these things will help you in scoring good numbers in question 1 now in my next class that is part 3 i will tell you how to write uh, question one sub parts like c d and e okay students so thank you so much and best wishes for your examination and preparation thank you